Do you ever find yourself with, you know, an afternoon off or a couple of hours free and you know you really need to take a rest and to rejuvenate, to refresh, to like, you know, really, really take care of yourself. And yet, you know, those two hours, those three hours go by and all of a sudden you wake out of a stupor of uh, Instagram scrolling or Twitter scrolling or checking your email and you don't feel that rested. Has this ever happened to you? Um, it's happened to me. And uh, I was speaking to a coaching client the other day and he, he really knew that he needed to rest. Like he needed to really take care of himself and, and really recover from the hard work that he'd been putting into his business and uh, his relationship and, you know, but he just couldn't come up with what would feel good, what would actually feel restful. So I suggested to him that he make what I like to call a self-care menu. Um, a self-care menu is a list of things that I've thought about ahead of time to do when I have time to rest, to recover. I don't call it a self-care list because I fucking hate lists. I do like menus. I love ordering off a menu. It's like fun, draws you in. So I invited him to make a self-care menu. So here's mine, self-care menu. Um, the list includes take a bath, read a book, do a guided meditation, take a nap, do some drawing, do some collaging, schedule a massage, have a massage, go to a museum, see some art, take a walk, read the paper leisurely, read a magazine leisurely, um, do a crossword puzzle, put on some awesome music and dance around. So I have all those things written down on this list. Why? Because when all of a sudden, you know, it's the end of the work day and I wanna stop working. Well, if I don't have something to take the place of work, it's very easy for workish behavior to sneak into that time. You know, checking my email. Oh, I'll just get back to this one person. You know, that's not restful. What we're trying to do is rest when we rest, recover when we recover, when we have time for those things to really do it. And I like to have a list, a menu, so I don't have to think it up. You know, my brain, my brain doesn't want to work hard at that time. It's tired. That's why I need the rest. So the menu, I just pick up the menu and I look, what are these things do I want to do? Take a bath? Awesome. I'll go do that. Put on some great music and dance around. Sounds good. I'll do that. So if you struggle to really rest and recover when you want to or need to, try making a self-care menu. I think you'll find it it's really helpful. And even just the act of doing it puts all these ideas into your head, whether you, whether you keep the little piece of paper or whether you don't. If you want more tips like this, if you want more, um, if you want more conversation like this that changes your mind and changes the way you look at the world and how you're using your time and your heart and your intuition and your rest, then uh, get in touch.